guys, this is my Uzogo drink. Yes. In English way of calling it is I think it's a viscous flour. Yes. But when we turn it like this, it turns to Uzobo drink. Yes. <laughs> welcome back to my kitchen if you are new to my channel you are welcome to my new subscribers thank you for clicking the subscribe button i appreciate you yes so to my returning viewers god bless you yes on today i will be making a very delicious healthy uzobo drink if you want to know how i achieved this recipe please stay tuned and watch so these are the ingredients for the recipe. Cloves, uzobo leaves, which is a, a discus flower, pineapple, ginger, oranges, and cucumber. Guys, whenever I make uzobo drink, I make it mostly for nutritious reasons, yeah. So I add loads of things into it that ensures that I am getting all the nutrients, nutritional uh, benefits that this drink has to offer us. Yes, so you can add whatever you want. Yes, but me, I like to add a lot of ingredients that will give me a lot of vitamins or uh, that will give a nutritional benefit. Yes, so right now we are going to be filling this uh, pineapple. I've already washed it, so I will peel it and cut it into chunks. Mind you, I am going to add the peel. You know, the fibers come from the peel, so I'm going to add the peel. <laughs> Second thing, wait. Orange. I'm gonna still peel the orange. I'm gonna put some of it, the peel on the back, yeah. Vitamin K, vitamin A, potassium, I mean, all is packed loaded in this ingredient. So, next, I'm going to, you know, cut it and um, put um, it back. As you can see, these are the ingredients for this recipe. Uh, uh, recipe. Yeah. 
So what to do next is in in here is water. Yeah. So I'm gonna add the isoro in here and quickly, you know, wash. Yes, guys, I'm washing it so that if there's any dirt in the water or sand, it will easily go off. So I'll quickly wash and put in here. Okay. So in here is my my clothes. So I'm gonna add clothes. Yeah. And I am going to add all the ingredients. Yeah, as you can see. Yeah, so I'm going to add them. See. I'm going to leave it to simmer for 25 to 30 minutes in a low heat, yes, so that all the leaves and other ingredients has enough time to release all of their flavor and colors into the water, yes, so that will give it a very flavorful usobo juice. So after 30 minutes, I will take, I will take it out of the heat, yes. And bring out all the pineapple joints, oranges, and ginger. There are so much juice packed in them. So, so all I will do is to remove them and blend them. You know, blend all the juice, the pineapple, the cucumber, and the, the rest of it. You know, I'll blend them and pour it in the zobu juice. It's loaded of vitamins, yeah. Vitamins, vitamins, vitamin K, vitamin A, and potassium. So, guys, I'm going to cover it and let it simmer for 25 to 30 minutes. Okay, guys. Guys, our Uzobo drink is ready, as you can see. You see how. The color looks like yeah it smells very aromatic mm, very nice so I'm gonna set it aside to cool for 30 minutes yes then we can see the Zobo drink then fish out all the ingredients then blend it and pour it into the Zobo drink it's full of vitamins with the juice yes it's full of vitamins and minerals yes so this is vitamin c vitamin k and potassium you are looking at guys please if you like my video don't hesitate to subscribe comment like and share yes so this juice is very healthy guys try and make it at home it is once on once every two weeks you make it is very very healthy very very healthy guys please whatever i put in here for you guys to look or see or everything i do for you guys and myself is healthy i do a healthy cooking so please Whenever I cook, please try and do the same. Okay? Alright, I will 
keep it aside now, we set it aside to let it cool, then we'll come back and sieve it and blend the juice. Right. Guys, as you can see, you see the Izobo leaf? Yes, I left it to simmer for 25 to 30 minutes so that the zoom and the zobo leaf and other ingredients that i add in it to be enough that I mean to have enough time to release all their flavor and colors into the water which gives this zobo a flavorful zobo juice yes so after 30 minutes i left it to cool down now I'm going to take out all the cucumbers, the ginger, the pineapple out of it. But first of all, I will feel, I will save it. Okay, you watch me now as I save. Guys, I'm saving it now. So watch. Hmm. Like this, there are a lot of juice left inside you see the juice it's still not finished so i'm going to pour it here i'm going to pour it here yes i'm still going to save the remaining one yeah are much of course the pineapple I'm gonna fish out the pineapples yeah I'm gonna fish out the pineapples uh, let me see wait, wait. I'm gonna fish out the pineapples but not the bag because when you add the bag it's gonna be bitter so I'm gonna bring out the pineapples I've washed my hands here. Yeah. I'm gonna bring out the pineapples and the, the cucumbers, the gingers. As you can see, you can see the juice. You see? So I'm gonna blend this. Yeah, I'm gonna blend it. So this is my blender. This is nutritious. This is full loaded pack of vitamins. Yeah, vitamins and minerals. Yes. Guys, if you want to add 
orange juice to make it more sweeter you can as well do like me now I am going to add this orange juice to make it more sweeter Wow, it's your choice if you want it. If you want to add your sugar, it's your choice. If you want to add your honey, it's your choice. Me, I don't eat sugar, so I added my orange. Guys, this is my Uzogo drink. Yes. In English way of calling it, I think it's Abyssus flower. Yes. But when we turn it like this, it turns to Uzobo drink. Yes. This Uzobo drink contains many antioxidants that increase a person's body metabolism and overall health. This antioxidant also help protect the body from free radicals, thus strengthening the immune system of the body. Hence, we all know that Uzobo drink can be used to maintain our flat tummy. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you, and God bless you as you do so. Bye. I love you all.